Mary Ellen Mark was an American photographer born in 1940 and passed away in 2015. Mary Ellen Mark's works are appreciated worldwide from her books, exhibits, and editorial magazine work. She has published works in Life, New York Times Magazine, The New Yorker, Rolling Stone, and Vanity Fair. She is recognized as one of our most respected and influential photographers. She is most famous for her portrait photos and street photography. This is one of her most famous photographs of Mother Teresa at the Home for the Dying, which is part of Mother Teresa's Missions of Charity in Calcutta, India. You can see that she chose to take the photo in black and white rather than in color. Mary Ellen Mark is well known for her portraits. From her website, I found many portraits of celebrities and actors. I found this portrait of Tim Burton really interesting because she took the photo of him on the set of his movie Sleepy Hollow from 1999 with a prop of a severed head. Again, she took the photo in black and white rather than in color. Another celebrity portrait I found was taken of Woody Allen from 1979 in New York on his balcony. I thought this photo was eye-catching because Woody Allen is the only focus of the photo. He is shown showing very minimal expression and you can see it was very foggy and rainy because we can see him holding an umbrella. For some portraits, she later began using a Polaroid camera in 1995. This Polaroid of Robert Downey Jr. was taken in 2005 on the set of Fur in New York. I found this photo interesting because of his relaxed facial expression with a cigarette hanging out of his mouth. It made me wonder if he took the photo still in character for the movie. Mark took many street photographs in New York City before and after she lived in New York. She has very famous photos taken in New York from the 1970s to as recent as photos of 9-11 memorials. One photo I found very captivating was taken of a blind man and his dog in the 1960s. I interpret this photo as being ethically evaluative because the man appears to be homeless or asking for help. He is seen with a sign around his neck that is difficult to read. Another ethically evaluated photo Mark took was captured of these two young girls in North Carolina in 1990. You can see both girls in a small kiddie pool. One is sitting while the other is closer to the camera and is seen smoking and holding a cigarette. This photo is eye-catching but also disturbing due to how young the two girls look. In 2014, Mary Ellen Mark received the Lifetime Achievement and Photography Award from the George Eastman House as well as the Outstanding Contribution Photography Award from the World Photography Organization. She has had an impact on portraits due to her ability to capture such simple but yet captivating photos of celebrities and everyday, everyday people.